One of the things that's always amazed me about luthiers is just how inventive and creative they are, particularly when it comes to solving problems. If you do a lot of the same type of rosette designs, or you may work in a production shop or a small shop, and you're having trouble taping the rosette using the technique I showed you with the fine line tape, you may want to check out this tool at Pro Luthier Tools. TJ Thompson came up with this, and what it is, it's a brass template that you order from him, giving him the exact size and specifications of your rosette. It's super simple to use. Let me show you. To use the template, you'll need some masking tape. I'm using the 3M Precision Masking Tape we talked about earlier in one and one half inch width. You'll need an X-Acto knife, and I'm using a number 16 blade, which is the one that TJ recommends that you use. You'll need the template, and all I do is I tear a piece of tape and when I'm tearing this tape, I'm careful because it's very thin and has a tendency to curl up on itself, like it just did there. Lay it down, smooth it out, and then lay the template. Over the tape. Then take your X-Acto knife, And as I'm cutting the tape, I'm beveling it just a little, the beveling the knife just a little bit. Flip the template up and free the tape. I didn't get that little edge there, so I'm going to score that again. Now, this tape is very thin, so be careful as you pull it and try not to have it curl back up on itself. If you find that the precision masking tape is just too thin to use, you can switch to a different type of tape, such as the green tape, and if you have the right blue tape, you can use that. This is the prop that we use for the hand applied sunburst application and this template was not sized to this rosette but I'm just using it as a demonstration. All you do, you take your tape and it's already cut to a circle so it doesn't wrinkle, it doesn't form those little pockets that finish and sunburst get under and it makes short work of doing a very clean rosette. As I mentioned earlier, if you find that this tape is a little bit too delicate and tears easy or is hard to handle, switch over to the green tape or if you have the right blue painters tape, use that. But this makes really short work and very clean work of taping off a very, very thin rosette or purfling line. As I mentioned earlier, this template is not sized to this particular rosette. It's sized for a little bit bigger size rosette with a bigger sound hole. However, as you can see, when you apply this cut tape down, you don't get any wrinkles or any of those little tents that cause problems when you're applying the sunburst color.